Blizzard is adding a new hero, and well, I feel like we've seen this before. <laughs> Maoga, the new Overwatch hero looks a bit too similar to Mawa from Moana, the Disney movie. Already after this announcement by Blizzard, there's been a ton of memes surfacing making fun of the new character coming to the game, but with all jokes aside, this guy looks broken. I don't know if you guys tried him out yet, but he's available right now in every other mode but comp. He's a tank hero, of course, I mean, look at him. And according to the lead hero designer for Overwatch, Alec Dawson, his primary function in the game is a damage based tank just to really go out there and inflict as much damage to enemies as possible while the rest of the team backs him up or focuses primarily on the objective but it's just another hero mainly for the new players to try out like soldier 76 something easy to just spray and pray and get a feel for the game before they try someone harder which don't get me wrong it's great for quick play arcade etc but for competitive i don't know how the hell this guy's gonna fit in blizzard is gonna have to work double to somehow manage that because just looking at gameplay he is gonna be broken Lots to nerf him coming and gameplay changes because he's gonna be the new meta for overwatch right now you can try him out i haven't given him a chance yet because i've been grinding in comp trying to get all my placement matches because i just got back into the game again but if you try him out let me know what you guys think of him in the comments but it really seems like overwatch is making a comeback for real especially with this new comp changes they announced lizard is finally moving in the right direction and i'm all for it i was pretty sad when i saw the second entry to the series failing so badly so glad they're taking in feedback from the community and really improving the game because after all these years, that's all we wanted for Blizzard to keep their promises, keep giving us new content, and making competitive better. Because honestly, that's what's keeping Overwatch alive. Personally, with loot boxes gone, I don't see a reason to play quick play. But those golden guns are really driving me to keep playing comp. And that's why everybody hops on Overwatch for competitive. Also, what's crazy is the Overwatch dev said that the new hero, Malga, was originally supposed to release at the start of Season 2 instead of Remetra. Sorry if I'm pronouncing the heroes wrong, I just suck at that. But point is, the team really wanted to take some more time before releasing this character so they delayed it and released everyone's favorite killing machine and it makes sense this hero is a serious tank that's going to change the way overwatch is played adding him to the game can be both very good and very bad because yes he's going to be a big damage character but he can completely ruin the balance overwatch sort of has now going on so far everything has been going smooth after all the nerfs and buffs they started the game with so who knows this new hero might just ruin the balance of everything that blizzard has been working so hard to obtain and that's that's one thing overwatch 2 does better than overwatch 1 and i've been hearing that from a lot of returning players that overwatch 2 feels way more balanced i'm excited to see where blizzard goes from here new season is in less than 30 days they're currently testing how well dwayne the rock johnson plays out in quick play and then after that they'll be adding him into the official roster of characters for overwatch and then he's going to be coming to comp which is something not too many players are excited for <laughs> i'm scared but yeah just want to talk on this for you guys in on what's going on with overwatch just talk about the new hero if you enjoyed what more overwatch watch be sure to leave a like subscribe for more and i'll catch you all in the next one peace out stay blue